I'm Corey Carmichael with the Memphis Tiger Network here at the Micro Soccer Complex where Memphis just picked up a thrilling 2-1 overtime victory over Missouri. Memphis jumped out to an early lead in the seventh minute with a goal by sophomore Diamond Simpson. The goal was a result of a free kick by Caitlin Atkins and was headed goalboard by Marissa Duguay before Simpson finished off the play. Missouri responded in the 26th minute with a goal of their own, sending it into halftime knotted up at one. Neither team scored in the second half despite several opportunities. In overtime, the Tigers got their revenge from last year's 5-1 defeat when Christabel Odor scored her 33rd career goal, tying her with Tigers assistant coach Jody Grant. We talked to Oduro, Diamond Simpson, and head coach Brooks Monaghan after the game. Um, it was awesome because I know I was not, me and Kylie weren't here to play last year, mm -hmm. so we were watching it over in Japan and we were just itching to get out there. And, like, it really hurt to lose 5-1 and to score a big goal against this team was just literally unreal. I couldn't even breathe for a second, so it was really cool. <laughs> okay. It's amazing. It sets the standard. Um, I think, yeah, we're here. We just set the standard and we just have to make sure we can play like this, if not better, because towards the end of the season, we're really going to have to buckle down and work and it's good to get a game like this out of the way early so we can refer to it later on in the season. It was a battle. It felt it felt good. Like The weather's hot, too, so I didn't know what was going to come out of our team. But coming from the first half and the second half, we bat battled it out. And obviously, I was feeling it. You know, I knew we had this game, and there's no way we're losing. So I knew we would win in overtime. Okay. Anytime you get a win against a quality opponent, it's a great feeling, you know, and have to credit those guys. They're going to win a lot of games. You know, they're extremely athletic. Um, they're, they're hard to play against, but uh, we'll take it. We'll take it. I was very proud of the girls overall, and they're just work great. It's, you know, tough conditions out here, Sunday game in this heat. But, you know, the girls battled through it and, you know, ended up obviously winning the game. You know, you knew that they were going to keep coming at you. You know, it's hard to keep a clean sheet against a team like this. But, um, you know, I just thought all in all it was a very good soccer game for a Sunday, you know, um, and hopefully we can just carry this momentum into Friday. Bye.